Hello and welcome to my quick tip on how to save as a PDF in Manga Studio 5, Manga Studio 5 EX and Clip Studio Paint. All you need is Manga Studio or a version thereof, a scribble on a canvas and of course an Adobe program like Adobe Reader or Adobe Acrobat. This probably works in every OS but the only OS I'm sure of it works in is Windows 7, which is the OS I have. So you just have to look around. First, go to File, Print Settings, and there you can choose any setting you like. Yes, we are going to use the print to print as a PDF. The pro of this is that you can choose things like uh, output range and print size. Hit OK and then hit File, Print. There you can choose of course your printer or your fax, if you still have that. Or you can choose an Adobe PDF. You didn't know that did you? Well now you do. It also works in other programs and uh, on the internet. Yes, it works in the internet, in Chrome and Internet Explorer. Here you can choose the settings like do not send fonts to Adobe PDF which you probably should uncheck. You can choose the color as black and white is good enough for manga or toned uh, comics. Uh, you can also choose, choose if your paper should be in landscape or portrait. For default settings, I would advise do high quality print, because otherwise your PDF will look blocky. Trust me, I've tried. So choose high quality print and hit OK. Or try to hit OK. Move, mouse. Move! There we go. Hit OK again and wait for it to load. Of course, if you find out it doesn't work in your OS, uh, please comment below and tell me so that I can tell people who watch this video. Also, if it does work in your OS and you want to tell me, go ahead. You see there are some artifacts. Um, don't worry about this. When you zoom in, which we will do later because first I'm going to, for some reason, open where I've saved it. Probably because I wasn't able to choose the name and choose where it had to be saved. You can choose this sometimes, but not this time it seems. Oh well. If you zoom in, you see the, see the lines are nice and clean. So it's just a viewing problem my Adobe Reader has. So don't worry about it. But because we choose high quality, the lines are crisp and clean. If you want to download Adobe Acrobat, I've put a link in the description as well as an annotation on the screen.